is Designer Danita, 419 Fashion House Creative. Today, I'm coming to you with a tutorial on how to make a layered tool skirt. For this tutorial, you will need measuring tape, pins, a sewing machine, matching thread, tweezers, a ruler, one and a half yards of lining fabric, and up to 40 yards of tool. cutting our waistband. The length of my waistband is actually going to be 45 inches. The width is going to be 6 inches. Once you've cut the waistband, you're going to fold it in half and iron it. Okay, so for the front, I cut it in the shape of a trapezoid. 20 inch wide at the top and just basically widen it to the bottom hem so it'll be easier to walk. We're gonna hem our front lining and we're gonna repeat this step and hem the back lining. Now that we've hemmed both pieces of our skirt, we're gonna mark exactly where we would like our tool layers to begin. I'm going with seven inches apart, so I'm gonna take my measuring tape and my disappearing ink pen and mark exactly where our layer would go down the center front and we'll repeat this step down the center back. Now that we have the center front of our skirt marked, we're gonna use our ruler and draw the line from the left side to the right side. purchase was 56 which is wide so if you divide that by four we're gonna go at 14 and we're gonna cut it in half so we would be pinning two layers together and then the top layer would be a folded edge making two layers as well if you want the skirt ultra full the way you've seen it in the thumbnail you're gonna actually pin all four of these layers together So we already pinned two layers together, so with the folded edge, we're going to pin those two pieces to the folded edge for four layers. When you get to the end of your tool strip, you're just going to fold that so it doesn't fly out of place. Now we're going to fold our tool layers and cut it all together so that the layers are even and sharp. We're going to base stitch across each strip of tool so that we can gather it. Okay, so to create our gathers, we're going to grab the needle thread from our base stitch, pulling the tool away from the thread we're holding gently until we have it the width of our lining. our gathered tool to our first line on our lining and we're going to start from the bottom pinning and sewing each row working our way to the top. Once you start pinning the tool to the marked lines you may notice that it's a little more gathered in certain areas so you'll take this opportunity to even it out before you pin and sew. open our waistband and pin one side to the right side of our fabric 
which would be our tool side. Now we're going to sew it in place. Flip the waistband closed. We're going to sew our casing, leaving three inches open, so we'll be able to insert our elastic. You're going to trim the elastic round on the ends. Using a safety pin, we're gonna insert our elastic through our casing. We're gonna join our elastic seams together by overlapping them with one inch and doing a zigzag stitch across. We're gonna insert our joined elastic and sew our casing closed. to finish the inseam by zigzag stitching or using a serge stitch. If you like what you've seen on this video, like the video, comment below and subscribe. Until next time.